The number one complaint people have about CRM is that it's just another thing you've got to do to manage your business. That's why Insightly has the Gmail sidebar for Chrome browsers. It lets you manage your business without having to leave your inbox. Let's check it out. First, you need to download the Insightly sidebar. You can do a quick Google search for Insightly Gmail sidebar and click on the Google Workspace Marketplace link. From there, you'll click Install and then Continue. You'll then need to sign into Google with your credentials. One thing to remember is that you must use the G Suite account that you use to sign into Insightly to access all of the sidebar's features. You will not be able to access all features if you use a different G Suite account or if you are a non-G Suite user. Once you give Insightly permission to access your Google account, you'll close out of that tab and reload Gmail. In your Gmail application, look for the Insightly logo on the plugin sidebar on the right-hand side of the screen. This will open up the Insightly Gmail sidebar, which will contextually populate with information that's useful for you. Once you get your sidebar installed, you can begin using it to access your data with Insightly. Here I have an email from Tony. When I open that email and navigate to the sidebar, I'll be able to see that Tony is not currently a contact. By clicking the Create Contact button, the sidebar will automatically load key information from the email and you'll have the opportunity to add more if you like. And there you go, your contact is now an Insightly CRM without needing to switch tabs or log into your account. Now that we have an official record in Insightly, your next step may be to create a task or link an opportunity associated with that record. For example, in this email, the client wants to move forward with a dance video. So let's add a task for me to send him a contract. I'll navigate back to my sidebar, click on Activity, then select Add Task from the drop-down menu. Doing so will open a tab in my browser for me to create a task, which will automatically link to the contact because I created it while I was viewing the contact. By clicking on Related, I can also link Tony to existing Insightly records, like opportunities or organizations. Just click on Add Link and search for the record in question. Simple as that. Now finally, the last thing I want to show you is how you can save messages from your inbox or sent folder straight to Insightly CRM. First, you'll open the email. From here, you'll be able to easily save the email, or if you need to do more, you'll click on the Save Link and More icon. From this screen, you can choose to save the email recipients as leads, contacts, or none, click the checkbox to save any email attachments, link other records to the email, or delete any contacts or leads connected to the email. When you're finished, click Save and you'll see a message confirming the email has been saved. And there you have it. In one click, your email is sent and saved to Insightly. So to wrap this all up, let's take a look at Tony's record within Insightly CRM. This record has been almost entirely created from within the Gmail sidebar. You can see the contact we created without ever leaving Gmail, the opportunity we linked him to, and the two emails we saved to his record. So now everything for your entire contact is in one place. If you want to dive deeper into Insightly's features or explore recent updates to the platform, visit the Insightly Help Center. Thanks for watching.